Just to try and create a bit of an awareness for the RSPCA, uh, and um, it's quite sad to see all these animals that have been left uh, and strayed and picked up in, in dumps. Uh, it's, it's, it's it's horrible to think that there, there are people out there that they won't care for them. And I've had dogs my whole life and pets, and coming from South Africa, there's animals everywhere. And, um, and I look at how well I treat my dog back home, and then you see these poor dogs who uh, who have been left just to, to fend for themselves. And then you spend an hour or two here and you realize the people here are, are, have taken them, taken them in and are looking to find homes for them. And it's important that people understand the effort that it takes uh, for, for people of the RSPCA to, to do what they do here and how much it costs as well to keep these strays and these dogs and animals and pigs and goats and horses that have been and cats that have been left um, you know, to just go away by our owners who have lost interest. And, I think that's why it's important for all of us to do whatever we can to try and help the RSPCA to make sure that, that every animal does have a home. It's a selfless job, every day cleaning these kennels, looking after all the animals. You can see them I and people are really passionate about what they do and trying to help these animals find a home and looking after these abused and forgotten animals, which is it's good. I mean, it, it does, I mean, I'm a sort of animal lover, I love dogs and cats and everything, so it's, it's, it's nice. It's a nice, nice way to spend your day and come look at all these animals and give a bit of love to them. Um, I'm Terry, I'm with the volunteers here, one of the many volunteers here at Southridge and I just want to say you know how much how indebted we are today to Saracens and to John and Justin in particular for coming along and sparing the time to see all the animals because here at Southridge we need all the help we can get to rehome them. We have about 60 dogs, about 100 cats, rabbits, horses, sheep and today with Justin and John coming along I'm sure they had a very good time when we, we met some of those animals as well and we told them about the problems we have and the work we do. We showed them around the kennel blocks, the cattery. We also explained how hard it is working here for rehoming the animals, keeping the centre going. I mean it's not generally realised the centre this size costs in the region of about £2,000 a day to run which is why we need all the help we can get and we're so indebted to Saracens today.